What's cracking with your snack and snacker stars? It is me, 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 the BRE, the man in the backwards hat, Brandon from the SAS, the Snack Food Appreciation Society. And ladies and gentlemen, this is a special report from the Snack Society. It is the ultimate Coca-Cola. That is right. My friend, the ultimate warrior, is here with me today to check out the brand new limited edition Coca-Cola flavor. Of course, back here on my uh, problematic property shelf. We've got um, several different... Hi, Henry. Let's not knock anybody over, okay? Anyway, we've got several different uh, Coca-Cola limited edition flavors from the last year or so. Uh, the Starlight, the Move, the Dreamland, and now the Ultimate. And the Ultimate apparently is a tie-in with League of Legends. This is Henry, who is uh, the coolest dude in the world, but he's kind of in the way right now, but that's okay. Um, anyhow, so it's tied in with League of Legends, uh, it's part of Coca-Cola Creations, and apparently it's XP flavored, so experience points flavored, I guess, is what XP means, at least that's what it meant back when I used to play D&D &D back in the day. So you're in a nice golden, golden, uh, can there, thank you, Henry, and, uh, it's just got some images that I guess are tied into League of Legends. I've never played League of Legends. I'm not as big of a gamer as I used to be in general, so that's just uh, the nature of the beast, so to speak. So, uh, let me go ahead and open this bad boy up. Doesn't sound like anything different, right? This is, of course, in the mini can. I don't know why they decided all these limited edition sodas need to come in the mini can. Uh, or it comes in a two-pack bottle, 20-ounce bottle. Um, haven't seen that one yet, but I did find this at Wegmans yesterday. Let me open it up. <sighs> nice cracking sound. Has your uh, carbonation, certainly. Go ahead and pour some of that into this cup here. Looks to be a little bit lighter in color than your standard Coca-Cola. Maybe a little bit on the golden side, which makes sense since the can is golden. Okay. It's pretty dark once you get into the glass, though. So maybe it's very similar in color. It's a little lighter. I don't know. Let me go ahead and get a waft of this here and uh, see what it does and how it smells. It smells like Coca-Cola to me, but like cheap Coca-Cola or maybe like Jolt Cola like uh, or a store brand. I don't know. Kind of strange, but I'm going to go ahead and try it out and see what it tastes like for you and let you know here on Special Report. Interesting. Tastes most, mostly like Coke right now. Might have like some cinnamon in it or something. Something like that might be going on. It's sweet. Maybe not quite as sweet as regular Coca-Cola. But pretty sweet. It's got kind of a drier thing going on. I don't mean like a clothes dryer. I mean it's drier than regular Coke. And it definitely, instead of being like fruity, it's got more like of a spiced note to it. Um really does remind me of standard cola of many different types just a uh, fancier spicier cola a little bit um maybe even like a cola mixed with a little bit of uh ginger ale perhaps i don't know i'm not terribly impressed by this this is certainly not ultimate in any way shape or form doesn't even touch uh stardust um Probably not even as good as Move, to tell you the truth. Um, just because it's not that different from regular Coke to me. It's just not. So with that said, all things considered, I think I'm going to go ahead and give this a half of a thumb up because it's just nothing special. And I'm kind of disappointed by it overall. What do you think, guys? Let me know in the comments down below or on the social media for the Snack Society, which you can reach on Twitter and Instagram at Brandon Reich SAS. You can join the Snack Society Facebook group on Facebook. 
uh, where we started, which has like 1,100 of the coolest people in the whole world in that group. And you should be too. Why aren't you? Also, ladies and gentlemen, make sure that you check out our Patreon. New stuff happening there all the time. Uh, if you feel like you want to buy me a burger or a Coke, go right ahead. If not, that's up to you too. I love you anyway. All right, guys. So make sure that you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Ring that bell to be notified. And in the meantime, in between time, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Ultimate Mike.